Hi guys, this is uh, Matt here. In today's video, as you can see, is uh, Perfect World. I got Fraps uh, yesterday, and now I'm test I'm doing a video on Perfect World because, well, there isn't anything much for me to do, I guess. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be re reviewing Perfect World to all you guys interested in playing, or just for something for me to do, I guess. Um, so let's jump right in. Perfect World is an MMORPG. Um, it is somewhat like RuneScape, but it's it's more towards um, World of Warcraft. Like the, the controls are a little bit different and everything. So let's go. It's two gigabytes. The file itself. It was released in August two thousand eight during the summer and I'm just gonna log in right now mm. oh yeah ah one second I for I don't have the mic stand with me right now so bear with me okay so I've logged in. I have my characters here. This is my main Smith Lord, and my friends just decided to test it out, so they made it. Me, uh, Magical Fruit was my friend Alex, and Drizzt Erdon is my friend Peter. Um, so there, as you can see, um, there's two races here, but there's a third one. It's um, a beast type character. I think I hope you'll be able to see in uh, when I log in. But anyways, level 14 wizard. Um, yeah, as you can see, 3D graphics, pretty decent. And here we go. Okay. So here we are. It says the title, Etherblade Outskirts. You have gear. Oh, where'd it go? Um, UI. So basically, while you're here, or while I'm here, it's got a whole bunch of these settings that you can adjust your game to. Now, I don't know how to get that back. Darn. Oh, here it is. Ah. Uh, anyways, getting back on track. I'm probably going to have to put this into two parts because it is... Okay, sorry about that interruption. Um, uh, okay. Uh, anyways... Sorry about that. It was an interruption. My dad wanted to do something for him. And I said it was busy. Um, so, yeah. Getting back onto the menus and such. You ha Most of these things are movable. So, you can move them around. Cust really customizable. It's a really customizable game, I have to say. And down here, you've got your bar. You, your, another task bar. Got, this is the logout and the exit to desktop, system settings, help, and contact GM. Friends, emotes, pretty cool. Uh. Um, new right players, friends, C Dragon, my friend Ryan, factions, com like, because it's still, I have to say, it's still an open beta, so... A not a lot. Well, a not. Oh, I can't say it. There isn't a lot of stuff that's been done. Like, for instance, Friend Finder, and Yawn, and Community. Like, it because they haven't got to it yet. Quest log. I was doing one. Stuff like that. Track and hide the quests. Skills along there. Character screen. 
your character, your level, your class, and some attributes. Inventory. Oh, my bag, the bag space, and right here is just some quick stuff that, like, if you need a mana potion or a heal, tell you to nearest town, town portal, pick up item, and meditate. This is pretty cool that RuneScape doesn't offer. I'm not trying to get into RuneScape, but I'm just saying. Push the meditate button. And you are in this little ball healing. I haven't been attacked yet, so I don't have or haven't lost any mana or HP. Now I'm gonna do the combat. I'm gonna flick a what's you got up here? It tells you the weakness. Weak against earth, so I'll just put my stone rain on, and he's dead because it didn't really matter. I was 14. He was what seven? I don't know. They drop stuff, just loot it. See a lot of people hang out here. Well, not, well, mainly because of this, I guess. You can jump really high in this game. Like, really high. You also get um, flying mounts, as you can see, flying and ride. But you will have to, you have to either buy them, I think, or you have to be a certain level. You have to be 30, 30, and 50, just speed. Can Panther, 40, 40, 60, 60, 60, and 60, 40, again. And you have all, oh, wait. Some other ones, spurs, and no, on their mind. Chat tab down here, say hello. Now let's go into the hand to hand combat. There's still quite a few glitches like this, the guys floating in air. But you rarely see them, I have to say. Chain down combat looks like this. So yeah, that was part one of Perfect World. The next um, part, I'm going to be showing you how to get quests, how to... I might put this into kind of like a series, like an introduction to Perfect World and how to do things. Um, bank, there's a bank, uh, skills that you can get, and stuff like that. Uh, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe. See you all later.